side mount to mount position. We will start with my partner keeping his elbows in as he should. That's good defense. Figuring four on his leg as he should. That's good defense. So on the bottom, he's doing a good job. I'll come in chest to chest and I will find a way to open his defense and work on my transition to the mount position. Okay, so here we go. Let's just start chest to chest. You can be on your toes, on your knees. It will not make a difference for now. One arm behind the head. Just trying to have my left shoulder on his jaw, not even holding to anything. Then my right arm comes under his arm. Just then I'll cup my hands. Do not open your thumb. Okay, if you lock your thumb, that's a stronger grip. So left shoulder on the jaw, up in my hands. His left elbow is not working so much as a defense anymore. When I drive weight forward and I push with my elbow, I will open his arm. Okay? So, that's good for now. His right arm is still in a good position. What I will do to neutralize his arm, I will come on my toes, shift my hips a little bit, Good way for you to measure. Bring your knee on his belt level. After that, you bring your knee on his ribs and you finally bring your knee on his armpit. This way, you're neutralizing his arm, okay? Of course, you will do so while you keep the grip. So on my toes, Left knee on his belt, left knee on his ribs, left knee on his armpit. Once here, it will be very hard for him to prevent my transition to the mount. Okay? I'll lean forward, bringing shoulder heavy on his jaw and opening his left elbow. Right after that, it's time to slide my right knee on his belly. At this point, release your grip. Help yourself here for balance. Your left hand now can grab the uniform. Spread a little bit your left knee. You should feel that you have a good balance here. See, even though my knee is on his belt level, this leg up was not enough to block my knee. That because right after I neutralized his arm, I brought myself high enough. You see, my left knee is even higher than his head. I brought it high enough that even though he's trying to block with his knee, my leg will pass real tight on his belt level. My right hand is there for balance. My left hand is grabbing for control. Now I will continue opening his elbow and my left knee I mean, my right knee will look for his left armpit. Look, from belt level to the armpit. Very important detail. And then I finally mount. Posting, posting. Then I can posture up. Knees on his armpit, making it very hard for him to protect his arms. Okay, let's take a look on a couple details here. He's doing a good job, elbows in, Figuring four, I have chest to chest. My plan is to open his elbows, slide my knee on his belt level and mount. Behind the neck, under the arm, cup my hands. On my toes, left knee on the belt, left knee on the ribs, left knee on the armpit. I'm high enough so my right knee will go easily on his belt level. Right hand for balance, left hand for controlling the uniform. 
Make sure to bring your right knee on the armpit. The reason why, if your knee is low here, when you try to mount, what you will find is that a lot of people will lock half guard. Eventually, they will come here, push you back to half guard. You don't want that to happen. When your knee finds the armpit, when he tries to lock, you pass over and you step next to his belt. That's your plan. Watch my right knee. He tries to get half guard. And I'll establish my, side, my mount position. 